bunch of laundry. And I want to get that done. Thank you, Lori. What you got? I love you too. Yes. Thank you. Hi. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. I love my little notes from her. Um, I didn't want to be doing all the laundry today like that, but I wanted to not really do anything for service tomorrow or well, after service. I just wanted to chill. And also, the funny thing is that I decided that I no longer want to be in the kitchen after Sunday service. We're away from the house like six out of the seven days. And usually Saturdays are what well, was designed, supposed to be for my downtime in the house, not going anywhere. But today is going to be a day that we're going to go to um, my daughter's um, really good friend's birthday party. So I um, already got the gift. It's already together. Um, and I did do all that earlier this week. Thank God. I didn't wait till the last minute. And um, yeah, we're just going to do this. Hezekiah is going to, of course, come with us as well, too. And um, we're going to have a good time. They're going to go jump and stuff. So <sighs> I'm a little tired, a long week. But I said, let's just get up early. Um, as you can tell, it's super early in the morning. It's like, I think it's like six. Hold on, let me see what time it is. Uh, 6.13 a.m. I know, for a Saturday. But I said I need to get just some things done. I need to get some things done. And they're up to, like, um, they ended up going to sleep like before 8.30 last night. So, and I ended up eventually went to sleep early too. This is why I was like, let me just go get up. I got up, I got dressed. Um, I got my face moisturized and everything. I did what I needed to do. And the party doesn't start until 3. And we're not that far from the location. But um, I don't know. I really just wanted us to get in the bed when we um, come back tonight. Just to get situated and relaxed. Um, I think I want to do a Walmart order as well too. For groceries. Because... Yeah, I'm, I think this week I'm going to make it a little bit more easier. Um, yeah, so we're going to go have fun. We're going to go have fun and then, uh, yeah, we're going to go do our thing. I don't think I've ever really gotten up this early on a Saturday morning unless it was for work. Um, usually I do wake up early, but as far as like getting up, getting dressed immediately and stuff like that, I usually like lounge for a little bit, but... Um, I just wanted to get in the mode of getting things done and I'm just so shocked that they're up so early like <laughs> yeah I don't know but um, I'll take y'all with me to the um, place we're gonna go and then we'll see what else is gonna be in the vlog um, so if you're new here don't forget to like share and subscribe thank you for joining and I hope you enjoy the vlog all right okay Okay, so um, it is now, oof, I can't believe I've been doing stuff around the house for like the past four or five hours. Um, it is now like 12 something. I need to get them together. I'm going to get them some lunch. I know they're going to eat at the party, but I want to make sure that my kids have something, you know, they're going to be jumping and stuff. So I wanted to give a couple of hours where they have like a heavier meal. So I'm glad to do that. And I decided, came this bright idea. I don't know why. Because I've been listening to a, a story, um, chapter book, and I had my headphones on while I was doing stuff around the house. I was doing a lot of shredding as well, too, a lot of shredding paper and stuff like that. And then um, the school had a shredding event today. It's $5 a box. I could have took it to the school, but I just wasn't prepared. So, And I don't know if they shred the stuff right in front of you. I'm not too sure. So... I didn't like prepare. It would have been great because I have a, and they didn't say how, they did not say how big the box had to be. And I got a big old box that where a whole, a whole po person can fit in it. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I came with this bright idea because when I took my son, um, no, I, when Lariah, I took her for her party last year, she had a jump party. 
Um, I it was just so loud in there, and I'm like, oh my god, everybody's screaming. Everybody. I said today I'm going to I'm gonna keep my headphones on. I'm just gonna go on my headphones. Like I don't know if I have to jump with Hezekiah or not. Um, hopefully I don't. I just don't feel like it because I know I'm already getting a little tired because I was doing stuff around the house. I did order my groceries. I did do um, clean out the refrigerator. I just did everything I needed to do. So um, to trash out, did all of that. So I'm like, uh, I'm getting a little, little tired, but it's okay. Um, the kids' clothes folded. I just gotta put those clothes away. I got one more load in the wash, one more load in the dryer. I need to just fold. That's my stuff, and I need to go through my cosmetics, but I'll do that another day. So I'm gonna take my headphones on me and I'll put some music in my ears because I'm like, it's gonna be kids screaming, yelling, jumping all the place because oh my god. And good thing is that I don't have to entertain everybody because it's not my party. <laughs> But we're gonna be with her little friends, her group of friends, and then it's gonna be me and Hezzy more than likely. Um, I am gonna hang out with the parents a little bit, but I know I need to watch Hezekiah. So, um, and we're going later because usually when we go, um, it's usually like as soon as they open up. This is a later party, so I'm hoping and praying that everything goes smoothly. Um, Hezekiah already knows gonna want his car. car and that's okay that's okay i'm okay with that i just hope that you know i'm just hoping and praying that everything goes smoothly with him um because i know when it's too many people he kind of you know gets a little antsy and stuff but all i can do is keep trying my hardest to put him into these situations and you know we're just gonna do the best that we can so i'm gonna keep myself calm have my music in my ears I already got a playlist together ready to go okay and we just gonna go. So um, I'll see you in a minute. You wanna find the wall? You wanna find the wall? Okay. Okay, come on. Hold this. It's okay. Hold that. Hold this part. So right here. the cutest ever so my children were blessed with these Easter baskets from someone that has been very sweet and dear to us from our church grandma Sophia we appreciate you so much she gave them two big old baskets of stuff and yes it has a jello in it and she went like all out for them we have the little dinosaur eggs in it um, this is Hezekiah's basket um, as well. Like, oh my God, just look at all this stuff with the little dino stuff inside. She got a lot of items here that um, their kids are actually able to use. And um, she is really so sweet. We really appreciate her. And she actually shares the same birthday with Hezekiah as well, too. They have the same birthday. So, you know, their birthday is coming up soon. So Hezekiah and Lariah both actually sit with her while I sing in the choir and you know I'm not able to leave Hezekiah like that because he can't be unattended. Um, for one he is only six years old and for two he is on the spectrum so he does get rather curious at times so 
you know, I have to watch him constantly. So, um, the church is very great at supporting me and filling in where I need so that I can support the church with singing on Sunday mornings. And, um, she is just so sweet. This was like totally unexpected. She put a lot of thought into these baskets for both of my kids. And, um, I'm just so thankful for, just her being just present and very supportive and really sweet, kind, and genuine um, when it comes to myself and my children. Her, like her whole family, they're really nice though. Look at these cute little items that the kids got for their Easter egg baskets from her. She also did uh, give them two big old, you know, life-size eggs with more goodies in it. So <laughs> the kids are really enjoying their baskets. So. Um, thank you so much, Grandma Sophia. We appreciate you. We really, really do. Okay, so the kids are chilling. Um, uh, finally, I'm gonna face the music with folding this last with laundry, and I'm about to get myself together so that we can go to bed. Uh, ooh, I need to finish it real quick as well too. But um, thanks for joining us, and thank you so much for joining. And I hope that you enjoyed the time with us today. And I shall see you soon. Are y'all? Bye.